These stone tools are very unique, very important, because they are the oldest stone tools found so far in the world. They are dated at 3.3 million years old, and they show that our ancestors, the hominids, were able to make stone tools before 2.6 million years old, which was, until this discovery, the oldest, the date of the oldest stone tools in the world. These tools were found in the West Turkana region of northern Kenya. This is a semi-arid badland environment, similar to what you would see uh, in New Mexico or Arizona. When we had finally convinced ourselves that these tools uh, were uh, napped by our ancestors and that they were surely very old, we started to jump for joy and then also thought, now we have to prove this to the rest of the world. It's a major discovery because not only we have anatomical or skeleton part now of our ancestors at that time period, but now we have the evidence of what they were able to make and how they were able to make them. We know that these stone tools uh, were made using different techniques than the one that we're using uh, later in time, and these techniques are a bit reminiscent of the techniques that are used by the chimpanzee when they want to break open their nuts. You can see that these stone tools were modified. They were modified by hominids 3.3 million years ago when they wanted to remove some flakes, so some fragments, some pieces of their stones to obtain uh, flakes with sharp edges. When we finally realized what we had just discovered, we were of course very excited, but also a bit scared because we're a rather young team of researchers and we didn't know if everyone would believe the claim that, that we would have to make that we had found the world's oldest stone tools. This discovery is a real reward for all these years of research uh, in this region and, and it's a real team effort. For me, this is a discovery of a lifetime.